<laughs> Hello everyone, I am wounded. I have been suffering with a knee injury from the gym for the past week. Agony. Honestly, you don't know how much you need to be in one piece as a mum until you're not. I am hobbling around but this house needs to tidy up and there is nothing like a fresh tidy up to give you like that fresh clear head which I need. Um, so yeah, hobble along with me as I try and tidy the space. I don't know why I look so bright tonight, but for those of you wondering why I go in with some Zaflora disinfectant concentrate after using Sip on the hob, it's because I like things to smell good. And this Linen Fresh smells incredible and it gives it that extra bit of shine. Like Sip, amazing for cleaning, but you don't really get like that glowy, shiny, lovely effect afterwards, which I love. So I always finish off with a bit of this or a bit of my Sip shine i'm just like trying to keep my leg up because anytime i put weight on it it kills um i mean i might as well clean the sink as well it is pretty clean but i've got the sif out and the sponge my little scrub daddy is already wet and covered in sif so let's just do it
a struggle because I literally cannot oh, straighten my knee. So we're gonna have to sit like this. <laughs> I've got my Senzaroma, Senzaroma, I always get that wrong, white now, because as you know, Blossom Bond Senzaroma white, you probably can't hear me because I'm making so much bloody noise. Put those down, but Blossom Bomb sends aroma wipes to die for. The consistency, how wet they are, the smell. I don't use anything else. But yeah, ignore my knee because this is hard work. And the cleaning must go on. Do you know what I mean? You can't just stop cleaning because we've got a bad knee. Out comes my Bim Bright, also Spring Blossom. Oh, the spray on this is wild. Like, if I spray in the middle, it covers both bins. Cool, so I must have been doing a lot of moaning about the state of my walls, but honestly, the grubby fingers, the paint smears on walls. My kids will do painting, stick their hands in the paint and then just put their hands on the walls, like, without realizing. Nightmare. So she picked these up for me. These are the, you know, the viral magic erasers. They are literally just like white pieces of weird, horrible feeling. Oh, can you hear that? Yeah, I actually hate the feel of these, but um, they're supposed to be magic. Why is there light across my face? You were supposed to not have to put anything on them and things just magically disappear. So we're gonna give these a go on the walls in a minute. Just gonna clean all of the kitchen covers just to finish off the kitchen. Um, I hoovered this morning, so I don't need to hoover. Apologies for the lighting. It obviously does not like me filming at night. Um, yeah, let's clean the, oh my God. Let's clean the cupboards and then give these a go. sitting down for a second just to take some pressure off the knee but I was just having a little read of this magic eraser and it actually says I was completely wrong wet the cleaning pad with hot water and then squeeze the excess and the magic begins magically erase those marks away I'm very excited to try this I absolutely hate the feel of it but hopefully it feels better when it is wet um first I'm just gonna remake the sofa because all the cushions are on the floor I've already hoovered in here because I hoovered earlier this morning, like I said. So I'm just gonna give it a quick tidy up and then see if I can get rid of some of those marks on the wall with this. Let's give it a go. Ooh, God, I can't. I can't feel it when it's dry. Okay, so we can see that black mark there, and then there's another one there. Um, the camera's finding it hard to focus on these marks, but there is a black mark there and there's one there. I'm gonna see if we can get rid of them with the magic eraser. Okay, I have soaked her in warm water and squeezed the excess out. Let's see the magic. 
<laughs> I give up. It's just made it darker. Maybe that's paint stripped off of the wall. Let's try something else. Here's a mark. Okay, that one went straight away. Wow. That one went straight away as well. Okay, that was obviously... That needs a repaint because that did not work. That just showed that the paint had been scratched off the wall. But the other two marks work really well. Look, we've got some blue marks here. Okay, now that's something stuck to the wall. I mean, my walls are an absolute mess. Let's find some more marks. Okay, so over here, we are marks galore. I can't bring you any closer because it won't focus for some reason, but I've got a black, black and a red mark. The other ones came off really well, so let's see. I mean, I think half of the paint's on here too, but... Okay, that one's not coming off. Are these dents in the wall? Okay, <laughs> I'm so silly. It, guys, it's like half nine and my legs are in agony. Bear with me. These are actually dents. I've just felt them. Let's actually find a mark. Oh, here's a black mark. You know when you want something to work so badly? Okay, none of these ones are coming off. Oh, okay. Three of them have come off and three were dense. So actually, if I just go around and take all of the grubby fingerprints off, I think we'll be good. So my conclusion is this works really well to take off like fingerprints and smudge marks, but don't try them on dense because obviously that's not going to work. And then some more stubborn ones hasn't come off, but I can see half of the wall paint on here. So I'm, I'm, I'm divided. I mean, if I go around every wall, I reckon I could get a lot of fingerprints off. Um, so yeah, I guess it works. I'm, I'm feeling underwhelmed. I don't know why. I think it's because they've used the word magical and magic all the way through their packaging when really you've only got rid of half the marks and I probably could have done that with a wet cloth. Um, so yeah, underwhelmed. Oh my God, now I just have water literally dripping down the walls. Hopefully they don't leave watermarks. Look what I've just done to the wall. Can you see that big dirty smudge? Obviously, if you look on this side, we do have lots of fingerprints and then I have just wiped them with the eraser and now I've got the biggest dirty smudge on my wall. Would you know, this is the time when I'm like, let me call it a day and go to bed because that is a joke. And then I just dropped it behind the sofa. Yeah, that's how we're feeling right now. So yeah, if you'd like to know whether I'd repurchase the magic eraser, I definitely wouldn't. Is that because my knee is in absolute agony? It's half past nine at night and I'm exhausted. It's nearly the end of the week. Maybe, um, maybe ask me another day. But right now, I would not repurchase. I've got to go and find the one from under the sofa and somehow fix the wall, which looks hideous. Um, so yeah, I'm glad I decided to <laughs> stand on my painful leg and try and clean the house. But I must say, let's look at the positive. The kitchen, chef's kiss it is fresh smells incredible it's literally like walking into zaflora paradise and it is so clean um the floors are clean the sofa and the living room looks nice i'm gonna have like half an hour just to chill out and watch something um before i head to bed but yeah downstairs is nice and clean and tidy and we'll leave upstairs for another day Time to get the peas out of the freezer and just watch some crap TV. But yeah, I hope you're all keeping better than I am and I will see you all soon. Bye. Oh my God, I can't get up.